Well, this really is a beautiful venue here in Riesenbeck. So many fantastic facilities. And I made my way out behind the warmer arena to this grassy area. And Irish rider Daniel Coyle is here, just giving your mare a bit of grass. Um, Daniel, tell me a little bit about the, what, what she like at a championships. Um, it's our first championship together, so we don't have that much um, experience at championships. But everything I've asked her to do so far, she's been uh, an amazing horse, amazing character. So. I'm hoping every day um, I look forward to it rather than uh, if I had a different horse you wouldn't be looking forward to the next day but with this one I am. Is she easy to have around? I mean she sort of seems pretty relaxed out here. Yeah she's uh, she's a mare obviously so um, I treat her a little bit that way also but um, she does everything everything that I ask of her so if she has her own personality that's up to her that's not up to me. And Daniel, there's quite a special story as to why she's called Legacy. Tell me a bit about that. Yeah, well, Ariel, um, who owns all the horses for me, decided uh, we were going to buy a new horse. And Jerome Dubbledam had been helping me at the time and says he has a, a, a horse he thinks is a real championship horse. And that's what we were looking for. So uh, me and Ariel went to Jerome's place and bought um, she was originally called Cheventel and Ariel's mother Sue was a big influence on, on my career already um, so then when Ariel took over the reins it was it was a real push for me because as a rider you never know when things happen and uh, Ariel's mother sadly passed away so then she goes and buys uh, Cheventel and renames her legacy so it's a it's a real big um, it's a real big thing for her to be here at a major championship with that name, with the background and everything else. Yeah, it's a very special story and we wish you and, and Legacy lots of luck.